Hello friends, welcome to the spoken tutorial on multiple plots. At the end of this tutorial, you will be able to draw multiple plots which are overlaid, use the figure command, use the legend command, switch between the plots and perform some operations on each of them like saving the plots. To record this tutorial, I am using Ubuntu Linux 14.04 operating system, Python 3.4.3, IPython 5.1.0. To practice this tutorial, you should know how to use plots interactively, embellish a plot, save plot. If not, see the prerequisite Python tutorials on this website. Let us first open the terminal by pressing Ctrl, Alt and T keys simultaneously. Now type IPython3 and press Enter. Let us initialize the PyLab package. Type percentage PyLab and press Enter. Let us create a set of points for our plot by using the command linspace. Type x is equal to lin space inside the bracket 0, 50, 10. Now let us draw a simple sine curve using these points. Type plot inside the brackets x, sin x. As we can see, this sine curve is not a smooth curve. What really caused this? This happened because we selected few points that is 10 for this large interval of 0 to 50. Plot function does not plot the analytical function. It plots the points given by the analytical function. Now let us use linspace command to get 500 points between 0 and 50 and draw the sine curve again. Type y is equal to lin space inside the bracket 0, 50, 500. Plot inside the bracket y, sin y. Now we see a sine curve with a smooth curve. Notice we will also have two plots one overlaid upon another. In PyLab, by default, all the plots are overlaid. To distinguish between two overlaid plots, we use the legend command. Type legend inside the bracket, square bracket, sin x, comma, sin y. The legend command takes parameter as a list of strings. Then it assigns strings to plots in the order they were created. Now we can see the legends being displayed for the two sign curves on the plot area. In the IPython terminal, now type CLF to clear the plot window. Pause the video, try this exercise and then resume the video. Draw two plots, first plot being a parabola of the form y is equal to 4x squared and the second being a straight line of the form y is equal to 2x plus 3 in the interval minus 5 to 5. Use legends to indicate what each plot is doing. Switch to the terminal for solution. Type x is equal to lin space inside the brackets minus 5 comma 5 comma 100. We can obtain the two plots in different colors using the following commands. Plot inside the bracket x, 4 multiplied by inside the brackets x multiplied by x. Plot inside the bracket x, 2 multiplied by x plus 3. Now we will add a legend to identify the plots. Type legend inside the brackets, inside square brackets, 
R inside inverted commas dollar y is equal to 4x square dollar comma R inside inverted commas dollar y is equal to 2x plus 3 dollar. We can see the legend added to the plot. Next, we will learn to switch between the plots and perform operations such as saving the plots, etc. Let us see how to accomplish this. But before we move on, let us clear our screen. Type CLF. Type x is equal to lin space inside the brackets 0, 50, 500. To accomplish more control over individual plots, we use the figure command. Type figure 1. Plot inside the brackets x, sin x, inside inverted commas b. Figure 2. Plot inside the brackets x, cos x, inside inverted commas g. Now we have two plots, a sine curve and a cosine curve in two different figures. The figure command takes an integer as an argument. This is the serial number of the plot to select corresponding plot. All the plot commands we run hereafter are applied to the selected plot. In this example, figure 1 is the sine plot and figure 2 is the cosine plot. For example, we can save each plot separately. Type title inside the brackets inside inverted commas cos x. Save fig inside the brackets inside inverted commas cosine dot png. Figure 1 title inside the brackets inside inverted commas sin x save fig inside the brackets inside inverted commas sin dot png the figures will be saved in current working directory now close both the plot windows pause the video try this exercise and then resume the video draw a line of the form y is equal to x as one figure and another line of the form y is equal to 2x plus 3. Save each of them. Switch to the terminal for solution. To solve this problem, we will use the figure command to create first plotting area. Type figure 1 x is equal to Lin space inside the brackets minus 5 comma 5 comma 100. Plot inside the brackets x comma x. Now use the figure command to create second plotting area. And plot the figure. Type figure 2. Plot inside the brackets x comma 2x plus 3. We will save the figure as follows. Type figure 1 save fig inside the brackets inside inverted commas plot 1 dot png. Figure 2 save fig inside the brackets inside inverted commas plot 2 dot png. This brings us to the end of this tutorial. In this tutorial, we have learned to draw multiple plots which are overlaid, use the figure command, use the legend command, switch between the plots and perform some operations on each of them like saving the plots. Here are some self-assessment questions for you to solve. What command is used to get individual plots separately? What will be the command to identify sine and cosine curve? 
and the answers are the command figure can get us the individual plots separately. The legend command legend inside the brackets inside square brackets inside inverted commas sin x comma inside inverted comma cos x. Please post your timed queries in this forum. Please post your general queries on Python in this forum. FOSSI team coordinates the DBC project. Spoken Tutorial is funded by NME ICT, MHRD Government of India. For more details, visit this website. This is Usha from IIT Bombay signing off. Thank you.